young Mark. Oh, it's like a flashback. It's, it's all your fault. <laughs> what? Calm down, Mark. Mark. <laughs> oh, what the hell is going on? Oh, please don't confuse me even more. Is this happening is or not? You are my patient here at Putnam Medical Facility in Chicago, Illinois. It feels like something's going on here. You think this is him doing this? I have no idea. All right, you're doing everything and everything possible not to look within. Don't believe him. Is that why you keep starting imaginary fights in our hospital? Imaginary fights, then why is he all bloody? What is going on? <laughs> His demeanor is different here. Is this supposed to be Mark? Before you got upset, you were talking to me about a boy? Yes, I think that little boy that might boy. be him. You were with a... Rhinoceros? It's a hippo, bro. Hippopotamus. You're right. I'm. S you're right. It, it was a hippopotamus. I'm trying to play him right now. Yeah. I feel really great. <laughs> I mean, <gasps> pay you a lot of money in, in this place. You know you're what? really good. This is Jake. That's a whole new accent and everything. With everything. Listen, I am not your enemy. Oh my God, this is so intense. Is he always so? Intense. Uh, for an Egyptian girl, she's very British. Ago, she is. <laughs> they made her look so realistic, bro. Because just a second ago, I thought that I'd been shot to death. I'm afraid you're actually quite dead. I'm sorry, what? 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 Huh? He's actually dead here? Are they in limbo? I'm dead. We're dead. Yes. Welcome to the realm of the Juat. Juat. The Juat. The Egyptian, the Egyptian underworld. Ah, this so it was the underworld. The goddess uh -huh. of women and children. And, yes, and we knew that. We Googled guided, it. She's guiding us through our journey to the afterlife. The afterlife? An afterlife, not the afterlife. Oh, I afterlife. love that. That's good to know. I wouldn't mind a choice. Like the ancestral plane. Oh, just gorgeous. The ancestral, ancestral plane, plane that's from, from Black, Black, Panther? Black Panther. Yeah, Black Panther, man. Oh, this is so interesting. Because the Duat's true nature is impossible for the human mind to comprehend. Right. You may perceive this realm as something more easily recognizable to you. They made it look like a hospital. Why would we imagine this realm to be a psychiatric hospital? Because we're insane. <laughs> that makes sense, because he thinks he's crazy. Talking hippo, talking dead bird. Mark. Is, we go through here, there's gonna Mark. be a bunch of patients, and there's Crawley, probably about to yell, Bingo! Oh! oh whoa. Holy shit! That is awesome! Is oh my god, it's so pretty. We dead as fuck! It's the underworld. I'm not crazy. He's excited, I'm not crazy. Who's dead? Where did you say we're going? Uh, we're sailing to our route. Uh, uh, to the field of reed, right, Tower Well, if your heart's balanced in life, then you will spend eternity in paradise. But uh, before we get there, I've just got to do a quick little... Uh, what the hell? What the fuck is she doing? Oh, what the fuck? Is that their hearts? Yeah, their heart. Oh, she's weighing our hearts on the scales of justice and the feather of truth. It's kind of like what Harrow does. What if they don't balance? You get thrown overboard. Whee! The dead will drag you down into the duat, where you will remain forever. Okay, well, let's hope they balance. Sad. There's no way we're even up down there. We're not going to feel the reeds either. All right, well, you're proposing. Kill the hippo, steal the ball. Kill <laughs> That's not gonna help balance your scales, bro. Why is it doing that? Why is it moving like that? Uh, I don't know. There's chaos in you. Yeah, chaos. That's what Harry kept saying. I was gonna say, oh. yeah, they're in conflict with each other. But the hearts, they aren't full. I think it's not balanced because there's a third personality. Yeah, it has to be the third altar. They need Jake. Oh. Without balanced scales, you what will eventually claim your soul. That's a little ominous. Do you have any other suggestions? This boat contains all of a life's memories. Get in there and show each other the truth. Not a bad way of showing an origin story. Yeah. I'm sure part of it's gonna be with the truth of what happened with Layla's dad. I don't know about you, but my memories are a freaking mess. Oh shit, when you beat the hell out of that nigga in episode one. Oh, that's so cool, that's from episode one. You beat the fuck out of that shit. Oh, when they changed the sky. Oh, yeah. We've seen all this, show us something new. Oi, what's this? I don't know, it's the street. You know, how many streets have you walked down your whole life? What are you hiding, know, Mark? You know. So that's the third person. Whoa! What the hell? This is some Marvel zombie shit. Yuck, I hate zombies. Just a creepy calf filled with dead bodies. Are these the people he's killed? Yeah, it's oh, just no. people that he's killed. Oh, are they gonna find Layla's dad? Do they need to add the ticking time bomb to it? It's a pretty good ticking clock. The scales are slowing yeah. down, it's working. Oh, the more he comes to terms with everything he's done. You go next um, to her. Who's that? 
Mom. <gasps> oh, no. And as a kid? Why is there a child in a room filled with people that you've killed? Oh, shit. Mom. <laughs> What's your name? Oh, hold on there. Oh, oh he's running. Why is he so scared of him? Never follow the creepy child in the middle of the weird psych ward. Come on, now wait. Uh-oh, uh-oh. No, what are we about to watch? It's probably a younger version of himself, a memory that he, like, keeps hidden. Open the door! Mom? Oh, no. Yes. It is his mother. Was that his mom oh. at the beginning? Who's ready? Who's hungry? Roro? Mom, come check out my drawing. Fish with one fin. He drew the fish with only one fin. Mark, be nice to your little brother. I had a brother. He didn't even know he had a brother. He doesn't remember his brother. That means something bad happened. What happened? What? They've gone too long. Oh, something's gonna happen to his brother. It's gonna be a real peacemaker situation, isn't it? Laters, Gators. He just said, Laters, Gators. Oh no, this is not good. Please don't let this brother die. Oh my god, is that why his mom doesn't talk to him anymore? Mom said not to when it's raining. It'll be fine. I'll be a baby. No, it won't be fine. Oh he drowns. no. If I see a clown, I'm trying to shit the fuck off. If I was the dad, I'd be like, you know what? I'm gonna go check on the boys. There's a very dangerous cave that I haven't boarded up yet. The bones. There's a little gun shoe. Oh god, no, no. Oh gosh, I'm scared to watch. You have to get out of here! They can't hear you, man. Why would they let their kids go down this? <laughs> His mom. Follow my voice! Oh no, no! Oh my god. Oh my gosh. It's just a memory. Bro, this nigga is traumatized. You gotta face your traumas, man. Was oh, this at his funeral? He has a tortured past, doesn't he? What are you doing here? You were supposed to keep him safe! Steven, let's go. Oh. You cannot blame a boy. This is all your fault! Oh, worst mother of the year award goes to that bitch. Oh my god. That'll certainly cause some drama. No wonder he's all <laughs> fucked up. This has got to be one of the saddest superhero origins ever. We're just about to blow out the candles now. She won't come down for his birthday party? So she just neglected him after she's all this. Coming. Oh, she's a real rotten bitch. Your mother's not feeling well, Mark. We'll do it just you and I this year. Are you kidding? You've still got one kid, ma'am. Hopefully you don't have any more kids. Dang, I feel bad for the dad. He's got to try to keep it all together. <laughs> Dang, it keeps going up and up. He's going to follow this kid all the way up to the fucking roof. You are always jealous of him. Dang, she still hasn't gotten over it. Ever since he was born. What? I sh should have known you would do something like this. Good lord. Oh my god. How can you say that to your known. son? What are you doing? Gosh, I can't even imagine what he's going through right now. I'm really glad that they're unpacking all of this, though. She's just breaking him even more. Cow, fuck that bitch. Oh, oh! What happened in that room? Something what? happened in that room. No, let him oh. see it. Damn, this is really good. This is a good ass episode. Why are you remembering her like that? It's not what she was like. He has a different view of her. Is that why he always calls her? So when he is calling his mother, who is he calling? What are you hiding? Mark, son, please come inside. Oh no. He's poor dad too. I cannot lose another son. Oh, he loves you. Your mm. dad loves you. Mark's gotta put himself first too though. He's so emotional. What the hell? Oh, this is when her father died. Harrow said you were a mercenary, that you killed hostages. Mark was not a good guy. God damn, this episode's heavy. Oh my god, this episode's so much already. Turns out going AWOL in a fugue state gets you discharged from the military. Didn't have a ton of options after that, so I went work for hire for my old CEO, Bushman. Ah, Bushman. Bushman? Who's Bushman, Hector? Part of Moon Knight's comic book origin. Bad guy. The job was to raid an Egyptian tomb. Bushman changed the plan, called for no witnesses, and I couldn't live with that. Hey, let's die. Oh, that's a scarf. He died trying to save Layla's dad. You know what? That makes me feel a lot better, actually. What happened to you? This is where he got saved, probably. So that's when he got Conchu. Conchu brought him back to life, yeah. All right. Oh, shit. This is Conchu's temple? It's like the Cave of Wonders, almost. <laughs> Oh, he crawled there. Oh gosh, he's a bit beaten. That's why he said when I found you, you were almost dead. <gasps> Whoa. Oh. Oh. He was about to clip himself. Okay. What a waste. Oh, there he is. God damn, I don't know what I would do if all of a sudden the statue oh, started talking to me. I am the god Conchu. 
in search of a warrior. Oh, good luck with that. To be my hands, my eyes, my vengeance. In exchange for your life. Damn, this sales pitch is kind of serious. I mean, it's a good proposal, especially at the moment. Man, what would you say? Yes, Kanju, I'll do it. Do you swear to protect the travelers of the night? Wow, so Kanju preys on people that need help. What a predator. He's more easily manipulated. He was manipulating you from the start. Yeah. Sounds like it. Yeah. Have we done it? Have we balanced them? Not yet. Then rise. Rise and live again. Oh live man, again. that's scary. As my moon knight. He said it. Finally, we hear the word. <laughs> that's fucking rad. So where? Did, what's going on? Fear is spreading in the upper world. Unbalanced souls are being judged and condemned to the sands before their time. That means Arthur won. No. Hero, you see why we have to go back? Dang, they're gonna free him right now? Oh yeah, free Khonshu, get sent back up, and then you could heal. Even if I could send you back up there, you'd just be returning to a body with a bullet in it. You wouldn't be able to heal. Can you send word to Layla? Please, help us free Khonshu. They need Layla to free him, so mm. then when he gets back to the body, he'll heal. This is our only shot. Cyrus is not going to like this. <laughs> Girl, a warning! Girl, I know, let me put my seatbelt on. Hey, yo, don't go on the sands now. <laughs> so the scales still aren't balanced. They gotta open up that other door, bro. Y'all gotta release Jake. Really wanna make the third altar, come on. There's that bedroom that you didn't want me to go into. That, that's it, that's where we're just like, just like, That's just where it's gonna balance yeah. those scales. Um, look, we don't have to go back through it all again. Oh, he doesn't want to relive it, whatever wow. it is. I think that's when Steven first showed up. If Layla dies, that's on your head. It'll be all your fault. No, 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 no you can't! I won't do it! Oh my god. Oh no, no, no. no. What the fuck? Mark, why didn't anyone put you in therapy? Oh my god, Mark! You watch too many movies. Bro, I'm so freaking confused. Oh, Mark. It's weird, Looking he's all healed on the nose now. Moment. Yeah, your nose is fixed. What the fuck is going on? This oh is like Inception. God. He's like three layers deep. I'm too hot for this shit! Do you think you created Steven to hide from all the awful things you feel you've done in your life? To punish the world for what your mother did to you? That's quite a question. Bro, this is crazy. Dang, this episode's like blowing my mind right now. I'm not even sure this reaction is real right now. Can you open up to Steven? This is my room. I remember some things, but I don't remember this. this There's a goldfish behind mm -hmm. it. Scales. Scales, yeah, I saw that too. Oh, right now. Just let my mom. Oh, no. I would be so scared. God, what does his mother do to him? Oh, shit. So this is when it started? This is when he was created. Putty hell. Look at the state of this place. This is Stephen now. Oh my god! When danger is near, Stephen Grant has no fear. Oh my god! That makes so much sense. Why am I actually crying from this? Open the door right now! You made me up. Open the door right now! To listen. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh! Oh my god, no ma'am, ma'am, no. Oh my god, his mom was out of control, bro. I didn't have to make him do this. I want to see what she did. I want to see what she did. What do you think she did? She whooped your ass, nigga! Not meant to see that, that's the whole point of you. That's the whole point of you. Wait, you want to remember the truth? You had a mother that beat you? Oh my god. That hated you? That, that made your life a living hell? But you've gotten to live thinking that she loved you, that she was kind, that she's still alive. Oh, fuck. Mm-hmm, there it is. Oh, that's why he's calling her. He calls his mom every day. She's alive, I speak to her every day. What are you talking about? That's why she never answers the phone. No, this is all wrong. Let me out, 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 let me out. <laughs> oh god, back to this shit. Hold on a minute. What's this? He's there, not Mark. It's Steven now, yeah. I'm here to help you. Dr. Harrow, yeah, is it? That's right. Oh yeah, look at that. <laughs> Steven! Wow. I love Steven. It's so strange. A little haircut, a little silly tash there. It's very Ned Flanders. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I brought this here? After your mother passed. Oi, 
Don't say that. That's not true. Oh, I'm, I'm so I must. Are you having a laugh as well? My mother is alive. You I, say that again, I, I will I, I, freak I, out. I promise. I must be mistaken. Yo, Oscar Isaac is the goat right now. He's killing this. He's so good. Would you Would you like to speak with her? What do we call her? I don't know if don't he wants to her. face it. Hey. Let's not. Don't bother her, please. Mrs. Grant. Yes, this is Dr. Harrow. She's not Mrs. Grant, though. Would you like to speak to your mother? Oh my God. Oh my God. Who's gonna be on the end of this line? Yeah. Well, there's no one on the other side. And he accepted it. That's important. The acting! Oh, this poor father. There he is standing yeah. on the street. He didn't even go in. That's oh, the that's... memory that he didn't want him to go to. That's why Mark didn't want Stephen to see. The fact he showed up, though, and didn't go in. He ain't trying to go to that bitch's room. She beat me. So we'll come in full circle now, isn't it? <laughs> Oh, poor thing. This is a lot. I feel so sorry for every single person here. Denouncing his religion? He's denouncing everything at this point. <laughs> this shit is harsh. This is brutal. <sighs> oh, he couldn't handle it, so he switched to Steven. Oh, what a transition. That's crazy. Hey, uh, Mom. Hey, you all right? Yeah, um... He's not really talking to anybody, is he? No. It's not an actual phone call, I don't think. I am totally lost again. I don't know where I am. Bruh. Oh my uh, gosh. This is it. Mom's death and shiver two months ago. So this was only two months ago? All those horrible things that she said to you. It was an accident. Like, I'm so pissed at her. I shouldn't have brought him in that cave. I shouldn't have brought him in the cave. Hey, he was just a child. You were. You were a kid. Was it you? Dude, now we have Steven helping Mark heal. His mom should have been the one to do that, mm -hmm. though. This episode is so heart-shattering, man. What is happening now? Is that the power of healing? Oh, the ship. The gates of Osiris. Come on, hurry. Yes, go, guys. Okay, so can they make it through? I've never seen the gates to the world above so close. How do I open it? I'm so sorry. Your scale's never balanced. Our journey's come to an end. Fuck. Do you think it's because they haven't found the third one yet? I was really rooting for you guys, but the unbalanced souls of the Juat now must claim yours. They're pretty balanced. That looks pretty good. Yeah. <gasps> oh no. What the hell is that? I hate that. No, thank you. I hate it. Oh my god. Zombies. Oh, awesome. Sand zombies. Oh, it's all the people he's killed. Oh shit. They coming for you, nigga. Watch out, watch out, watch out! Oh, no, 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 no! Watch out, watch out, watch out! Yes! Come on, Steven, you gotta drive this boat! Whoa! He over here slinging his boat. Steven is the captain now. <laughs> oh, shit, what the fuck? You got this, Stevie, come on. But if I'm you, it's I've got this too. Yes, Steven! Better up! No! Yes. Let's go! Wow, Steven! Wow, Steven! Oh my gosh, he's going Negan on his ass. We got a lot of pent-up British rage there. I feel like more are gonna come up from the sides, you guys. <laughs> oh! 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 <gasps> oh my gosh! Oh, Steven! Ah! No! Oh, shit! Get up and run, dude. Oh my god, stop the phone! No, he's done, bro! Yeah. That's so sad! I loved Steven! Oh no! No, oh. are we gonna lose Steven? We are not losing Steven! No! Did you see Inside Out? Like he's fucking Bing Bong from Inside Out? You're killing me here. Steven! No! Are you kidding me? Are you serious? What? Oh, damn. Oh, my God. Oh. He's been bing bonged. How is that oh. possible? Maybe he needed to accept that this was an altar. <gasps> it's balanced now. The scales are balanced. <gasps> the field of reeds. We had to toss Steven overboard for the scales to balance? He don't no. want to go on an afterlife like that. <laughs> It's 
where this episode's gonna end, and I'm gonna be mad. Better not. Because it really feels like they're about to. Don't. I swear to. Oh, come on! You water water! Why do they keep doing this to us? Uh, that was a fantastic episode. Holy crap, that was so good. Guys, this episode was incredible. This was probably the most emotional episode of the show. That is up there with Wanda. You knew it had to be trauma that created Steven in some way. Grief will do crazy things to you. And not to mention his dad that didn't even do anything. Like, bruh, you just let this shit happen and been like, well, she's sad and she's upset. Instead of being like, bitch, get it to fucking gather. We literally have one episode left. I don't know how this is all gonna end with one episode left. We need to see what happens with Amit. We need to see what's going with Harrow. I can't wait for the third personality to show up. And I feel like there is still the chance of Khonshu reviving them. Hold on, it's gotta be a mid credit, right? <laughs> that hippo was misleading. I was promised a fun time. Allá del sol.